All right, I'm just going to carry on where I left off. So we're now going to switch to talking about uh, web browsers, okay? One of the most painful things I've noticed about the web browser is you got to say any search engine. Um, and, like, let's click the address. It didn't automatically highlight it. Now, come on, Linux. What if I wanted to copy that? All right, well, don't worry. It's uh, hit Control-L. And the next thing you should probably do is hit... Control X or Control C to copy. Um, so that that much you know about. Now it's the hotkey is Control L to get up to that address bar, which is the same for any utilis is Control L. Uh, so that's a universal thing, and this is actually more efficient than moving your hand to your mouse and then moving back and hitting Control A and then doing whatever. Oh sweet, someone answered me. <laughs> One, because I am a four packer on a gateway laptop. Sorry about that. <laughs> Tears. <laughs> uh, all right, where was I? All right, hit Control L. That's that's that. Now hit Control Shift Y to show your downloads menu. Very fun, very cool, very happy. You'll notice install. Uh, you should install Chrome. Firefox came as default. You should also get Chrome. So just download it. It's going to download a cool dev package. Once that downloads, it'll be hit Control Shift Y, open up your little download thing, and I think you just double click it, and it's a dot dev package, and then it's like, all right, install package. Click that. It'll automatically install. It'll place Chrome here in your thing. Go ahead and click it, get into it that way. Firefox, by default, thank God, has already been installed. But you need to make some tweaks, and I'll show you those tweaks right now in Firefox. I don't like to tweak Chrome. I like to think of Chrome as, yeah, that's the fastest thing possible. You can't get any faster. And so don't add add-ons that will just goob it over like awfulness. Um, Okay. <laughs> um, so, uh, I'll have to edit this. I'm very sorry about that. Uh, tools. All right, so we need to install, first of all, our search bar. We had to delete that, and I forgot how to delete that. Okay, hopefully uh, I can get to the bottom of that. Uh, okay, so first things first, we need uh, mouse gestures. So go ahead and Google right now mouse gestures and install it. Uh-oh, type in Firefox. <laughs> Google makes us so lazy. And then choose all-in-one gestures, or the other one. I don't know anything about either. Oh, I, I use this one, and it slows down my Windows machine considerably, I think. I, I something does anyway uh, so anyway click download put it on and that'll work and then you have to go up into here Ooh, a message Kentos it makes an event visible with this event hmm hold on a second Back to what I was saying, um, we need to uh, install some more add-ons. Um, <clears throat> uh, another add-on, other than I believe I just went over mouse gestures, is Tab Mix Plus. 
and the first hit or the second hit that's going to do it install this add-on and then when it's finally installed you have a little option down here tab mix plus option off of tools go in there and you want to go under events open new tabs next to current one that's the only reason you have to install this huge heavy piece of software now when you bring that oh really okay now when you like middle click to open up a new thing oh really oh wait oh I was right here I'm sorry I looked at that and I didn't realize alright so now let's say we're right here if you want to open up a new tab it's gonna open right next door and if you middle click oof, we have to make one more change and I'm just gonna I'm not gonna pause it because I don't want it to bug out we just need to go open other tabs next to current one okay only if related to current tab change opening order eh, maybe that works uh, now I'm gonna middle click and there you go that that works and it's very spectacular having my mouse wheel be able to change tabs of course you could additionally I think there's some kind of a arcane way of doing it um Okay, so that's uh, that, and then you of course need add stop, add stop plus. No, it's add block. I'm sorry. <clears throat> add block plus for Firefox. Uh, go ahead and click it, and then when that thing is installed, you got to block add-ons. So even going to disgustingly messed up websites such as DreamInCode.net you uh you can navigate oh i don't know uh clear your cache and then it it will be all cool anyway that's enough for web browsing um mouse gestures oh yeah we were in the middle of setting up mouse gestures okay so go in there find uh i sometimes you can just go add-ons and then all-in-one gestures preferences and then you want to clear out anything that's like any uh, anything and then a direction. You want to clear those out because they'll, they'll mess your opening up. And then I like to have open tab, new tab and foreground to be just down. And then duplicate a tab, down up. And then close current tab, down right. And then uh, that's, that's all I use. Um, and then to go left and right, of course, I, I I use the hit left mouse button and then click right mouse button. And the other way is the opposite way to do stuff like this. So, you, yeah, going backward, going forward by just using the two mouse buttons that everyone is uh, born with. Um, that should do it for browsing. We installed Chrome. We install. We have Firefox already installed. Oh yeah, clear out that thing. I think you can right-click it or something, and then you might have to go into About Config to further customize uh, this thing. Uh, s search. Let's just try search. Uh, y you'll have to Google for that. <clears throat> Um, because, because it didn't seem right to be telling everyone, all right, oh, and here, this is pretty important, right here, keyword.url, that makes it so anything you type in here, hello, yo, any two-word thing you type in there is going to take you to a search engine, and then any one-word thing you type in there is going to work anyway, yeah, and that's because of that keyword URL, um, yeah. So that concludes this recording, and uh, we'll pick up on more stuff next.